The winner is... He's the most famous person you've never heard of. He was the most brilliant and successful young producer in London. The 60s and the early 70s wouldn't have been what they were without Michael White. In any period, the last 40 or 50 years, Michael was probably there at the center of whatever the pop cultural thing that was going on at that moment. Yoko Ono, Miss Ono's film, will be shown in the men's toilet of the theater. Michael's the most hidden man you'll ever, ever meet. One minute he's hanging out in some grungy bar, then he's dining with Thatcher. He certainly was by far the first person to talk to me about Kate Moss. He was the only one that could really keep up with me. If he was a suit, he had a great one on. He trusted us. He thought we had talent. He's a subversive. I always found him a charming enigma. Arts, visual arts, poetry, film, drugs, sex, and rock and roll. Lots of late nights, lots of drugs, lots of drinking, lots of parties. Name me one! One thing, just one thing in that entire program that you find offensive. Well, the sickening perversion I found in it. Then something went wrong for me. To be a theatre producer, you have to be a gambler. Here was a different sensibility. Someone who was quite brave. Do you have any desire for stability and continuity in your life? You'll get that when you're dead. You'll have lots of stability. You'll be stuck in one place forever. So. I think while you're alive, you have to live. Science fiction.